Welcome back to my channel, everyone. I apologize for looking like this, but I'm in the process of deep conditioning my hair because I'm going to be flattering my natural hair as well as my weave today because I'm just really ready to flat iron it for the first time in a year and some odd months. So I'm like really anxious and nervous but very excited. So I'll be letting you guys know how that goes. But yeah, that's my explanation on why I look like this because I'm also in a rush and if I got ready, this video would not be made right now. So, as you can see is in the title, um, I'm reviewing Curl Genetics Curly Clip-Ins today. And I was so excited to be sent these, like I never had extensions before, let alone a sewing weave, nothing like that. I just had braids and that was the first time ever. So um, this is all new to me and very exciting. So um, the box looks like this, well the box is. And they sent me two bundles of the Curl Genetics Natural Texture Hair Extensions, 100% Virgin natu Natural Hair Extensions. Oh my gosh. So they ended up sending me 16, 18, and 20 inch extensions. And they all came in the color black. And I'll put a picture. <laughs> And they were super, super spirally and curly and match my hair texture so well. So basically, Curl Genetics is a website that you can order hair from. Not only just clippings, but wefted wigs and wefted hair. And it's supposed to natu I mean, naturally mimic your hair texture for natural hair. Now, everybody has natural hair. It's just depending on how you choose to manage your hair. Um, so probably people with perms and uh, damaged hair, you would not want this unless it was a wig or sewing or something like that. Um, but the clip-ins are for people who want to wear their natural hair and blend it with the extensions. So that's what I was planning to do. And I absolutely fell in love with the hair when I first got it. It was just beautiful and it was so soft and it was just great all around so the hair I um, ended up getting the curly texture and this is some of it and it's still curly but the only really bad thing that I had to say about this hair was the hair does not take to color very well now I don't know if other people had this experience with the hair but I did and my mom is a, a licensed hairstylist so she knows how to dye hair and stuff and this hair just did not take to color like how I expected it would so um, each of the bundles comes with seven pieces to clip in and they look like this sorry they're all nappy right now but this is a four clip one and they hold on your hair really good they don't hurt they're they're really really good so what I ended up doing well the problem that I had was um my hair is a soft brown I mean not soft brown a uh, dark brown and these came in black as you guys seen in the picture um so my issue was I'm gonna have to dye all this hair. So this my um, mask is squeaking, but um, I'm gonna have to dye all this hair. And when you dye natural hair, the curl texture gets looser, and that's what I did not want to happen because my curls are really tight, and what they turned out to be was very loose. Um, loose curls I still found a way to manage and make it match with my hair but that was just a downfall of it all so I'm probably just gonna be smarter about it next time I just really was upset that this did not take to um, color as well as I thought it would I use cream of nature dark and lovely and then bleach for tips now the bleach did not even take that well I I mean, I wanted to go for, as my regular hair, a blonde tip, 
and this is like the lightest it was going for me and I wasn't gonna keep it in like over 30 minutes and it just the 30 minutes only turned it this but I'm really still happy with the clip-ins now um I'll post the picture but on my Instagram I have a picture of me with my little side braid and a lot of people loved it and they everybody thought my hair was real they were all like oh your hair grew so fast and stuff but that was a good thing because this matches and um really blends in with your hair good so this is all I use these are all the clippings I use for my um side braid <laughs> it worked so well so yeah these this is all the hair so basically I really like this hair and it's so versatile clip-ins are the best now I never had a sewing before but I can tell you before that clip-ins are probably your best bet because you can take them out you can move them to the side like when I did my braid I basically braided my real hair all the way to the side my real hair all the way down here and my real hair down here but before I started on this side I put like four sets of clip-ins in and then just finished braiding my real hair and it looks so real and with a sewing you wouldn't be able to do it as well you can have as much leave out as you want you can you can do so much stuff with it, it's amazing. I love the clippings and I'm just really happy that Crow Genetics sent me these. Thank you guys so much. I had such a great time with these and they're, they're really great guys. And another thing, they're high maintenance, which is you have to put your hair products that you would for your real hair into these. Now you gotta wash it, deep condition, all that, detangle and everything, but it's really, really good. So, I'll let you guys know how, um, after I flat iron them, how they revert back and how everything went. So, thank you Curl Genetics for sending me, again, these curly clip-ins. I love them so much. Um, I really only have one problem with them, but I'm good. So yeah i hope you guys try these out because they're very very good so yeah that's it i'll let you guys know how my straightening process goes with my real hair and the extensions so catch me in my next video everyone